What if California's Salton Sea had never become a toxic wasteland? In the 1950s, this desert lake was called the Riviera of the West. Luxury resorts lined pristine beaches, yacht clubs hosted Hollywood stars, and beachfront mansions dotted the shoreline. But imagine if it stayed that way. If tourism had continued, strict environmental controls would have prevented agricultural runoff from poisoning the water. No massive fish die-offs, no toxic dust storms choking nearby communities. The thriving resort industry would have demanded clean water, forcing California to completely rethink its water politics. Desert development would have spread differently across Southern California. The Colorado River Basin's entire ecosystem would have evolved along a different path. Instead, we got one of America's worst environmental disasters, a place where the air is now poison and the ground is littered with fish bones. The Salton Sea became a warning of what happens when we ignore nature's limits. One decision could have changed everything. 